Alright, we're going to try to do a, a tutorial here. I've been asked to demonstrate how the moving camera works. So we're going to do that real quick. No. I'm assuming you know how to make a replay. Uh, so if you don't, you probably don't need to know how the camera works. Um, let's see. First, let's uh, let's start a recording. Get a little replay going. We'll drive around. Maybe hit a rim or something. There we go. Okay, and I'll stop the recording, and it's going to start replaying it. So we're going to pause, put it on zero, and pull up F10. This is your uh, your world editor. And then we're going to click on the camera path editor. And hit new. Okay, now you get in your, uh, your camera where you want your initial position to be. Doesn't really matter for this tutorial, so we're just going to put it anywhere. On the car, I'll put it right there. That's fine. And then we add a marker. I'm going to pull this open a little bit so you can see it better. And then add a marker. And then move forward in the replay controls up here. I'll move forward a second. And two until it starts moving. There, it's moved a little bit so we can move the camera around however we want it. Add a marker. Move time ahead a little bit. Move the camera. Whatever you think will look good. And add a marker. Now you don't want to make <coughs> radical changes, uh, otherwise the camera is really going to jump around and be uh, kind of uncomfortable for the viewer. So if you want to change position in the car, do it gradually. You're going to add a marker, move forward in time, reposition the camera. Add a marker, move forward again. And you don't have to go one at a time, you can go two at a time, whatever you need to do, depending on the scene, how fast the car is moving, etc. I want to start pulling back here for the jump shot. Add a marker, move forward. There we go. Car's in air. This is a beauty shot right here. And add marker, plus one. Go over here. Kind of back out a little bit. Add a marker. Plus one. Backing out. Add a marker. Plus one. Car's coming to a stop. We can zoom in a little bit. Add a marker. And it's done. So now you're going to, at this point, start your screen capture software. Get that running. Start recording. Then you're going to want to hit this button play, which closes the editor. And immediately pause, because you're going to have some stuff on the screen here, likely. Rewind it. Hit Alt-U to remove stuff on the screen, the user interface. And then unpause. Now we're going to record our scene here. Nicely, that was beautiful, and that was it. And you can also go in and edit your path. Say uh, there was a part you didn't like that was too jerky or something. You can grab one of these nodes and move it around. Like say this one here, it gives you, you know, the uh, the moving bits, whatever they're called. Grab this one, move it around, play with it a little bit. And play and close the editor. Hit pause. Rewind this thing. Alt U to hide the uh, controls. Unpause it. And we'll see if that was any better. That was actually pretty cool. A little jerker right there at the end. But you get the idea. And if you have any questions, or if I left something out, or suggestions for a, a new video, please comment below. Thank you.